if I go to jail because I said the truth about the evils, I will still come out and get worse, especially against the fight for Biafran freedom. Aside the Kubo one. Well, um, Aside Kubo is a known enemy. Yes, he's a known enemy to the Igbos. Forget uh, the lies he has been telling of being an Igbo too. Yes, if you actually trace his background, okay, he still have the blood of an Igbo, of an Igbo man in him because the father is actually an Igbo man. But he chose to follow the line and the religion of his mom. And that is why you see him bearing Asari Dokubo. Asari Dokubo has been a bottle in the neck of many Nigerians. He has been a problem. He has been uh, a fight, a, a fighter. Not in support, but against his own people. Look at someone who is claiming to be an Igbo, fighting against his own brothers, against his fellow Igbo, Igbo brothers, you know, shutting all of them down, you know, planning evil about them. And he's, only, he's the kind of person that is only after himself and not after the other person. In fact, let me, let me, let me quickly go to the content and get you sensitized. This is today's news. During one of his live section on Facebook, Asari Tokubo, a former Niger Delta militant leader, said, If I go to prison because I said the truth about Lagos or about Igbos, I will still come out and be worse. So don't bother. In this country, Nigerians, there is freedom of speech, so I can say whatever I want to say. According to him, Oaneza said DSS should arrest me within 48 hours. Are they now the police or the authorities? In a country where there is freedom of speech, some people will not speak their mind. Are only Igbos entitled to speak their mind? If anybody says anything against the Igbos, that person should be arrested. In his words, they are those whom you can intimidate with arrest. So don't bother yourselves. I am not afraid of being arrested. The courts are there and they will set me free. If I tell the truth about Igbos and go to prison, I will still come out. So don't bother yourselves. I have been in prison several times. I am not Namdekan who is crying to be released. He was a lion outside prison. Immediately he got into prison, he became a mego cat, an ordinary pussycat from lion to pussycat. <laughs> ah, this guy, no be small madman. Hey, no be small. See what he come as in the canoe. Eh? Which can person be this one? All right, my people, when I don't hear the story as it take happen, aside the Kuba don't come as it nam the canoe, um, pussy cat. <laughs> okay, um, as the story they go, we go still hear more. Uh, well, aside the Kuba of a truth has gone to um, jail many times. In fact, he is one of the uh, one of the militants that was sent to jail as many as possible and he still came out but then i uh, that doesn't mean that he will be comparing himself to nam Kanu because um nam Kanu is very responsible compared to asai dukuwa you understand so um saying that he he, he, uh, he he will be out is because of the the the, the relationship and the secrets that he actually 
has with the top politicians. So he believes strongly that with them, he is 100% covered. So that's why he's bragging. Be that as it may, my people, uh, now, uh, aside the Kubo, no be person where person could they, um, could they put all in um, many talks with. Okay. So please um, don't forget to comment. They are still very, 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 very much of great importance. Don't forget to leave your comments below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to, to get updated. Each time we upload any new videos, thank you.